So I am back out in my favorite part of the woods on my farm for the third year in a row and it is just a beautiful day out here today. I do feel a little sad that I left the Mamiya RB67 at home but I have the Intrepid 4x5 Mark V with me instead and I'm really excited about that. It's a still a new camera to me uh, so I'm enjoying familiarizing myself with it in already familiar surroundings. Uh, one thing that I do like about taking out a new format is that I get to revisit all of my favorite subjects and not feel guilty that I'm taking the same shot over and over again because now it's on a different size of negative. Uh, so today is absolutely an Ektar day, one of my favorite films to be shooting in the woods. So I've limited myself to one film, one camera, and I'm going to just enjoy the day and revisit all of my favorite subjects again. So let's head out there and find some trees. This is one of my favorite trees on the farm. This maple is somewhere between 150 to 200 years old. And while it has seen better days, it's still standing strong, which is what I love about it. Uh, I find that when I'm walking in the woods, when I come across this tree, it's just a bit of a source of comfort for me when I see it's still standing there. So I always like to try to capture an image of it. If you've noticed around me, the colors are more veered towards the yellows and greens. We've had a few fall storms come through and so of course the red leaves are the first ones to fall to the ground. Uh, so while that does mean a bit less of a variation in color, it also does open up the canopy allowing little pockets of light to come through like you see on the bark at the base of the tree, which is what I really like about shooting in the woods this time of year. One thing about shooting large format is that you only have as many sheets as you can carry with you. Uh, so I'm going to grab this shot and then make the best out of what I have left of my sheets of film. So I haven't actually really tested these film backs out just yet. Uh, so I'm doing my best to shield the film from light by using the dark slide on top. Now I'm set up at F22 half a second so I'm just going to wait for the wind to die down a little bit and get this shot.
So that's it for me for today. Uh, the winds have been steadily picking up over the afternoon and I'm also out of film. So two really good reasons to call it a day and head on back in. This time of year, the weather is very volatile. We have a lot of storms that come through. So the winds do tend to pick up and a lot of the leaves are going to be falling. I'm expecting that the next time I'm back out here, everything is gonna look very different.